The troubled Atlanta Falcons were begrudged this one moment of glory in the very last minute of play when rookie Mike Donahue beat Cleveland's Ernie Kellerman for a seven yard touchdown. But Kellerman was rarely beaten for the better part of the day as he and the rest of the revitalized Brown defense buried almost every Falcon attempt to move the ball. The Browns spent so much time in the Birds offensive backfield they started some plays of their own. They get you from the outside and from the inside. So you put in a new quarterback and what happens? They come from the outside again and kill Randy Johnson too. Cleveland pressure caused each Falcon quarterback to throw for an interception apiece. The fired up Cleveland defense led by number 88 Ron Snydo dumped Johnson and Barry seven times for a total of 51 embarrassing yards. And the healthy Brown offense was equally overwhelming. Leroy Kelly was busy pleasing the Cleveland fans by using every trick in his wonderful magic show. When he couldn't turn one corner, he went back the other way. And when he could turn the proper corner, he did, with a special mixture of power and finesse. He carried 19 times for 119 yards, over the 100-yard mark for the fourth time this year. With the help of an effective offensive line, another trick, a slant off right tackle that looks like a 40-yard dash. Amazingly, Roy accounted for two touchdowns and thoroughly made up for his poor showing two weeks before when the Cleveland fans saw the Cardinals hold him to a mere five yards. The Leroy Kelly comeback story must have been required reading for the rest of his teammates too. Veteran Paul Warfield turned a first quarter Bill Nelson flat pass into a 32 yard rump. In the second quarter, Nelson connected with Big Milt Morin for 52 yards. In the fourth quarter, Nelson and Warfield teamed up to complete the humiliation with a 22-yard touchdown. The day clearly belonged to Cleveland, who proved their win over Baltimore the week before was no mistake and stayed nicely tied for first in the division.